everybody, this is Elissa from Mink Arts and Crafts. Today I have an unboxing for you. I'm going to do two kits uh, from Paint Gems. I'm going to do the Doors Edition and the Masks Edition. And these are two of their latest uh, brand new uh, new releases. And I am, as Moji makes her presence, uh, just passing through. Come on, keep walking, little one. Keep going. Interloper. All right, let me move the cat. Uh, so I am going to do an unboxing for you guys of these two kits that I am super excited about. Uh, I think these are going to be my favorite of all of their um, releases that they've had so far. Uh, and the reason why, every time I see an interesting door as I'm out and about exploring, walking around, I have to take a photo of the interesting door. Pardon the unnecessary loud motorcycle outside. Uh, they like to gun it up and down my street. Um, so anyways, every time I see an interesting door, I have to take a photo of the interesting door. So I was super excited when I saw their doors edition. And then the other one that we have is the masks. And uh, big thing for me is anywhere I travel, uh, whenever I go on a vacation, I always have to buy either a painting uh, from the country that I've traveled to, or I have to buy uh, and try to find a mask. So I've got a wall of masks that I've purchased from all the countries that I've traveled to as we get a little cat paw in the corner. So I was super excited when I saw these two kits come out and I had to snag them up. And once I finish the rainbow uh, edition, uh, which I'm going to finish this month, then I plan on kitting up one of these two new um, packages in these new kits and working on these. So we're going to open the doors edition first and then we will go through masks. Let me side masks to the side and we are going to do Doors. And I love how they show you what the designs are. Um, so when I actually open and like hit up one of the paint gems, I cut this square or this rectangle out um, and I'll keep it, I'll, I'll kind of talk through what I do. But I love their packaging that paint gem does. Um, and if you do, if you take this off, they still show like a, a label here, paint gem mini 34, that'll correspond with the colors so if you do um, have the box separate from your drills you can know what you've got so we open up the box I'm gonna take everything out of the box so you can see here are our drills and I do like that they have them in the plastic baggies because if I travel somewhere I don't bring the whole package I will typically just bring the canvases the sticker sheet and what I do is I cut this out and I stick this inside with the sticker sheet. Mochi wants the box. I'm gonna set the box to the side for us so she can have the box if she wants. I take the sticker sheet and I take this and I put it inside with the canvases if I'm traveling. Um, so that way I've got, but we're gonna go over our Toolkit, so you can see what comes in a paint gem uh, toolkit. I like their little canvas bag that you can repurpose afterwards. So you get a white tray. So there's your little white uh, boat that you can use with the drills. When I travel, I use um, a Bella Art uh, De Nicole um, tray that has a lid so that way I can, you know because usually I'm working on it on a plane or something like that when I'm traveling. You get your white tweezers, which work just fine if you need to pick up. They, they are fairly sharp for being plastic tweezers and not metal. They are pokey and sharp. You get a sparkly white um, pen with the metal tip, and it does come with a, looks like a three-placer, you get a grippy, and then you also get a large, um, looks like a 10, nine or 10 placer, but a larger multi-placer. So, and that is what you get as your toolkit with it. So everything that you need, your boat with your pink or your little pink wax, 
Um, just make sure you take the plastic off the pink wax with the heart in there. And then your multi-placers, two options for the multi-placers. And that is your toolkit. I'm going to leave it here because other mo otherwise Mochi is going to decide that it is a toy and she must play with it. So our colors. Uh, and this particular kit has 44 colors for the doors. I'm not going to take them all the way out because I don't think I could. I do you can get them back in fairly well and what I like is that they actually come in with the number of what color they are and if you want to kit them up like this then you just take your sticker sheet and slap your sticker right on your baggie and then you just know hey that's 310 that's gonna be this one right here 310 so they do come in the order that they are right here I haven't found one that's not in order so as you can see with our colors here, you can say, all right, there's number one, 5,200. Then we come down through 712, 739, 437. We've got a couple interlopers in here. I'm gonna set that over to the side. our sticker sheet we've got a 782 307 Ooh, that's a really bright one I don't know that I've seen that color before 725 we've got 741 970 and you can see some colors you're not gonna have a lot of and some you're gonna have a lot like 666 is one that's got a fair number of colors in it 304 we got 747, 3766, 798, 963. Look at those pinks, 3716. Ooh, I love the 899. A couple interlopers, that bag wasn't fully sealed. Uh, and that's, this is why I like to, unless I'm traveling, I kit them up in other storage containers. They're 601, 964. Ooh, I like those colors. And these are squares. 959, 38, 12, 211, 3078. Ooh, that's a pretty color. 209, 38, 37, 453, 452, 38, 61, 38, 60, 402, 37, 76, 301, 400. 704. I love these greens that they have. The 701, 699, 3846, 996, 995, 796, 415, 414. And then as we come into the 3799 and the 310. So there are all of our colors, all 44 of them right here. So you can kind of see that color palette, a little bit of a glare on those there, but there's our colors. And then we will go into the canvases. So for this one, we will have uh, 12 designs for these here. Um, so we've got door number one. I'm gonna slide that one out of the way. There's door number one. Door number two, a pink door. Door number three, or well, I guess these are in reverse order. And then you've got, ooh, that one's a pretty one. A yeah, nice yellow door, red door. You've got a green door there. We go back for another pink door with some flowers around it. It's a red curved door. You've got a blue door. It's a purple door and another purple door, but different shape. So there are our doors that you're gonna have. And this is going to be the first one of the two kits that I purchased. So you've got the 12 doors. I'm gonna put them back in the proper one through 12 in this order. So, this is the doors set and I'm excited 
for kidding up the doors with their 12 uh, kits there and there's the toolkit so that is the doors uh, newest new release from paint gem just got uh, just arrived in the mail this week I was super excited for it as soon as I saw that it came out I had to snag it up now we are gonna open up the masks set and those are just labeled as door design 1 through 12 now for the masks I'm gonna keep my cheat sheet handy because that will tell you what um, where the mask is from. So I'm gonna keep my cheat sheet handy. You can see the Paint Gem, their nice packaging. I like their smooth slimline packaging. You can see this is kit number 33. This one, the doors were kit number 34. Uh, I'm not gonna go over the toolkit because the toolkit will be identical to the toolkit that we just went over there. So I'm not gonna go over the toolkit. Here we've got their drills. Uh, this one has 37 colors. Sorry for the crinkle as we open. All right. So you've got 5200, 712, 739, 437, 436. This is going to have more browns just because the masks in general are going to have more browns. 434, 801, 938, 3078, 973, 725, 741. Making sure, I like to go through, make sure they're sealed. There's 301, that nice program, 704, 702. 701, it's nice pretty green. Then you've got a 699, a darker green. Roll into 352, 666, nice big bag of 666 with that red. And then there's a 304, which is a hefty bag of that particular red, a deeper color. 815, and then you've got a small bag of 519. 3760, 3842. And they tend to have theirs set up kind of in like color families, so the color shades kind of rainbow down. Uh, and then you've got 211, 209, 3837, a tiny bag of 747, 3761, this gorgeous like aqua 3849. Right there, slide those up a little bit for you. 3847, 762, 415, 318, 414, 3799, and a fairly good sized bag of 310. I don't think I've seen a bag of 310 this large on a paint gem before, because that's, that's the largest 310 I've seen on a paint gem. But those are our drills, only 37 on this kit. Um, not too bad there compared to the 44 on the other one. And now we're gonna open up here. And you can see this is what I'm used to seeing the other, where they keep the sticker sheet on the top there. And then it's up to you whether you wanna slap the stickers on top of each of these baggies so you know what you're working with. Or if you wanna slap your uh, stickers and put these baggies on their own um, individual containers and kit them up. I tend to kit these up on my Elizabeth Ward trays. Uh, so we're gonna go over them. So our first one you can see here, this one is a mask from Korea. So it's a, a Korea mask. And I'm gonna apologize for the glare. The second mask that you see here is an Aztec mask, mask number three, and there's 16 in this kit. Mask number three, I have to go over because the what the one thing that usually bothers me is that the order that they give here is not the order that they put on the bottom of these canvases. So that usually bothers me and kind of throws me off because I feel like I have to go in the order. For me, I have to go in the order that it shows here. So Korea is a one here, but it's on the bottom here. 
This mask says Aztecs, but it's the first one there, second one there. Then number three, this one is Africa. Number four that you can see right there, that one is, doo -doo -doo -doo, let me find it on here. That one's another Africa mask. And then as we come into five, you can see number five right here, which is, a, these are all super awesome. I absolutely love these. So number five, let me find it on my list here to see where that one is from. That one's gonna be another Africa mask. Number six is going to be Inca. Seven that you see right here. Try to get it so you get no glare on it. Because the plastic, the plastic is what's giving it that glare. So, this one is going to be another Aztec. Number seven, which, oh, I love these. These are incredible. I'm, I'm like, I'm super excited to do these masks. I think these are going to be my absolute favorite kit out of all of them. Um, so this one is going to be Maya with that one for number eight. Number nine. Try to get it held just right. So number nine that we have right there. This one is going to be another, let me find it on my list here, do, 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 another Maya. Number 10, this one uh, is super cool, that's China. You can tell by the dragon. Number 11, that one is China as well with that different look to it. Super cool. Number 12. That one's super fun. And this one here, with the tongue sticking out, we are going to have from Hawaii. Uh, and that one's a fun one there. And then you come down here, number 13. This one, of course, is another Hawaii mask. Tiki masks, number 14, right there. You have, see this is the hard part when they're not in order and you have to hunt back and forth and find them. This is Venice. And then, as I put it, did I put it in the right spot? No, I did not, right there. And then you have 15, which of course, not very hard to tell where that one is, that's Mexico. And then 16 is also going to be Mexico. So I am extremely excited for these ones. Um, the masks are gonna be my favorite set out of all of them. I encourage you guys, if you have never tried a paint gem, these are super fun canvases to do because they're small. I'm gonna do this if we can get rid of that glare for you guys so you can see them all. So these are super uh, small, compact canvases. As you can see, they don't take up a lot of space. Um, they're about the size of a hand. They're usually the canvas and all is uh, approximately the size of like a five by seven photo. So they're small, compact, they, um, they're square and they work up pretty quickly, which is one of those things that's fun to do. Um, they're great for if you want something small and compact to do, or if you want to be able to have a, a fun little project to work on in between projects or if you're traveling. I like these for when I need a break from working on a big canvas or if I'm just, you know, if I'm traveling. So I've taken these and I've actually worked on these on the airplane before on some of my kits. Um, I was doing that with the National uh, Parks kit. Um, I work on them in between the larger kits that I'm doing. They're just, they're very versatile. They're super fun to do. And I love how they look and I love how they turn out. And I think it's fantastic to be able to have the variety. And it's like for one price, you're getting six, like in this kit, you're getting 16 different kits. This one, you've got 12 different kits. And like the color spread that you get with these is fantastic. So these were the doors. These were the masks. And I am looking forward to being able to work on them. So, uh, go ahead and uh, check out their website. They've got a lot of different kits that you can work on and uh, see what they have to offer. Um, 
So if you guys want to go ahead and if you have not already liked this video, go ahead and give it a like. Um, that's the button right down there. And if you have not already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe as well and go ahead and click that, click that notification button as well. So that way you can know when I post my videos. You're pretty much guaranteed uh, three videos a week and then any extras if I do uh, other stuff such as unboxings or month in reviews or any other uh, videos that you may see that are not my normal work in progress or whip and chat uh, video, my, uh, um, my normal small shop haul Sundays that I do if I have anything to work on for those and then post reviews. But I try to do three videos a week for you guys and potentially more. So if you have not already, go ahead and sign up and subscribe and give it me a like. But otherwise, I will see you guys in my next video. Have a wonderful day.